Deep in the forest of Albion lay the small town of Oakvale, unchanged by time and untouched by the sword. Here lived a boy and his family, a boy dreaming of greatness, of one day being a hero. Sometimes he imagined himself as a noble knight or a powerful wizard. And other times he dreamt he'd be an evil warrior. But in all his dreams of greatness, he could not possibly imagine the power of the destiny that lay before him. Come on, wake up. Daydreaming again, were you? Just like your mother, mind always wandering. Well, let it wander off to find your sister, will you? She's out playing by the Barrow Fields gate. Remember, you haven't given her a birthday present yet. Don't tell me you forgot to get her one. Well, I'm not bailing you out this time, son. Hmm. I tell you what, I'll give you a gold piece for each good deed you do around Oakvale. That should be enough to buy her a present. Now, get moving and stay out of trouble. Well, 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 well. Hang on, let me, um... I know. Just, just stop that, okay? Uh... Audio... Let's turn that sound down just a little bit more. And that just a little bit more. What the hell are you playing? This is Fable the Lost Chapters. I've always wanted to do this game. I love this game. This is my favorite game of all time ever. And I wanted to do a little playthrough on it. I, I think it'll be different and neat. So let's get started. I've lost Rosie. I left her and I can't remember where. Her stuffing needs changing today and I can't find her. Please help. She's a lovely little furry bear with a blue patch on her back. Hmm. So we gotta look for a bear? Alright, bear. Hello. Somebody keeps whistling at me. I'm just like, hello. I don't know you. <laughs> um. Where would this bear be? It's been. You farther around? Oh my god, these guys are loud. It's been years, and I do mean years. Honestly, where's that good for nothing Since I've played this mine? game. Uh, and I mean, it, it's. I need to turn down the voice volume just a little bit more, don't I? Uh, audio. Let's turn down that sound dialogue just a little bit more. And that just a little bit more. And click apply this time, dummy. There, it's better. At least you can hear. You can just see what happens. Um, this is one of those games that. Um, you better. This is where I say. When I like to do exploring type of games, this is where I got it from. See, I can break this stuff and do an evil deed, but um, considering that this game is based upon whether you do good or bad stuff and how much you do of it, it alters your look. Like right now, I'm you know pretty much a normal boy. Um. But the thing is, you do a bad deed, and as you get older, you actually grow horns and stuff, or wings. And I've always beat this game on evil. And I do mean every time I've ever played it, I've always beat it on evil. Evil, evil, evil. Because it's the easiest to do, because it's easy to kill the villagers and take all their stuff and stuff like that. So I figured. I want to go through this one time, at least, and do good deeds, just to see if um, if it's at all possible to be beaten on good. Because the rumor was when I when I found it, I'm just doing small missions here. I gotta find her husband, but uh, I've always heard that you can't beat it being good because you don't have the necessary powers to beat Jack of Blades. Jack of Blades is the main bad character, so. 
I want to see if I can play through this and actually beat this game being good. I want to talk to him. Stop it. Look, son. <coughs> Sorry, I'm just going to breeze through the childhood because it's just little quest here and there. Just don't tell my wife. You know, it's just little stuff. Pick up the game, play it yourself. You'll see what I'm talking about. I just want to blow through this first part and get to the interesting part. Da -da -da. Run down the hill. Where's this lady at? Wasn't she like right over here? Yeah, there she is. Hello. Hey. Yeah. You already know he's cheating, so how would you know that he's right up the hill from you? Right, thank you, young. We're gonna go over here. We're gonna go beat up a bully. <laughs> Nobody likes bullying anymore. What do you want? Nobody yeah, look at this bully. Look at him. You can tell he's a bully just by looking at him. I want more Oops. pocket money next week. Get out of here. Get yeah, that's right. That's what ha that's what should happen to all bullies. Go away. What this done is you remember the bear the little girl wanted? Well, this is where you get it. I know I'm blowing through these, but as a child, it's really just nitpicking quest. It's not until you get older that it starts to really get interesting, because you get, like, a sword, a bow, you get armor, stuff like that. Um, Rosie, give her her bear. Such a little girl. You're welcome, honey. Now, um... Gotta go turn this stuff into dad. That way we can get some money. Do, 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 do. Well hey, done, Dad. Man. What's up? Here's your award. Well, give me my know. money. That's all I care about. Thank you. Run back down here. Get a present for our sister because today is my sister's birthday. Uh, Teresa is my older sister, <laughs> uh, just to fill you in on some of the backstory. Well, yes, I know. Shut up. That's the only thing about this game is it's kind of it gives you that um, explorer feel. You got to be ready to read and make sure you're doing what you want to do. I'm gonna run up here. Oakville is a beautiful town, isn't it? You can tell this is an old game just by the graphics of it. That ain't the computer, that's the actual game that looks like that. Um, it's definitely fun to play. Like I said, this was originally my absolute favorite game ever made. Like, they made three of them. But two and three were okay. They were more modernized. You had a lot more missions, I mean, you know, stuff like that, but like my dream. Yeah, we're just getting out of that, because I already know what's going to happen. Da, da, da. Wait, there's something wrong. Here's a little bit of backstory for you. Uh, when the cutscene comes here in a second, I'll let you see this part, because this is what makes...